I'm Andy, and this is my wife Claire. In this video, we head out onto the North Yorkshire Moors to Whitby Holiday Park. Will a clifftop view set the scene for an amazing weekend getaway whilst we have a whale of a time drinking beer, eating pizza, and watching a swinging live band? Or will the discovery of a terrible smell in the van prove too much even for the dog? With lots to see and do in Whitby, keep watching to find out. After a long week, Claire came to pick me up from work. Right, off we go. Whitby it is. I'm starved. Shall we just get a bit of a snack or something? No, we no, no, no. We're having tea when we get to the pub. It's my treat. Aren't you hungry? I'm peckish, but I'm fine. That's weird. It smells like mayonnaise in here. Have you, um, have you dropped any mayonnaise or something? No, but I need you to put the fridge on. Right, here we are. Woohoo! Look at the view! Look at the view. <laughs> Look at the view. Yeah. They're seeing it bad either. <laughs> More like wet bee. It smells a bit in here. It doesn't. It does. Can't you smell that? Nope. I can. You got your gloves? Yeah, they're not you... in my hat. Oh, don't my gloves are. I've lost them now. They're in the hat. Again. Oh, yeah. Is that do you do that? Are you doing that for a joke? <laughs> I'm not. I'm 100% not done that for a joke. This is now Pablo. Pablo. Hello, boy. Totally different. It's cold. Embarrassing. Raining a little bit, but it's nice, isn't it? Yeah. We so, don't care, do we? We don't care. We don't care about the rain. We're not bothered. We're from Barnsley. A bit of rain has never hurt anybody from Barnsley. No. We've got we these great Look views. The sea. The sea's beautiful. You've got your rubber shoes on again. Do you want to just check I can bring the dog in? After a rainy walk on the cliffs, we found Whitby Brewery, where we settled in with a couple of pints, a pizza, and we watched Mike D and the D-Tones play a blistering set featuring rockabilly hits from the 50s to the present day. If you ever get a chance to see this band, they're well worth a listen. After a wet and windy walk back to the van, we got inside to discover a dreaded leak in the roof. However, the next morning, due to the beer from Whitby Brewery, I'd forgotten all about the leak, and I set upon my day. There's nothing better than a lovely soft croissant. <laughs> they could warm it up over there. Are you sure they're not them that they put in uh, show homes where they're plastic? I don't know. You can soak all your bacon juice into it. <laughs> so that's breakfast done with. Another good one. So we're off into Whitby now. Yep. Oh, English Heritage membership. Are we a part of that? Have no, I got a sticker for that? No, we're National Trust, don't we? National Trust. I won't be too shocked if you were. Get myself a new uh, sticker. I wonder if she's got any stickers. Shall we read what it says on that? Just, to, I think mm. it's something to do with Dracula, don't you? 3,000 years. Mm. Yeah. Doesn't say anything about Dracula. Mm. Are you sure? Yeah. Henry VIII, look, reduced it to ruins. You were a bad boy, him, weren't you? Yeah, well, yeah. Your favourite, though, isn't you? He is, yeah. It's fascinating. Like bad boys, Claire. I'm married you. So what's what's this church then, Claire? St Mary's. St Mary's. Have you just read that or do you know that? I know it. Do you? Yeah. How can we know it? Um, I don't know how I know that actually. Do you want to go down the steps? No. Those 999 steps. How many steps are there, Claire? Do you know? 199. So, is this the start? Yeah. Are we counting? I'll lose track. The dog's probably going to collapse from halfway down. Probably wrong decision. Here we go. These are famous one, steps. 1, 2, 21, 22, 33, 34, 50. 
57, 58, 59, 77, 78, 79. Are you still counting? One, two, three. Yeah, don't put me off my count. I might have miscounted you. What have you got two? What, 146. <laughs> I got 196. <laughs> it's 199. What, did you get 190? Did you count? Yeah. I got 174. Duke of York. Including dogs in the boarding. You're, you're very welcome here, Pablo. Whitby Jet. What's a jet? Abbey Jet. Whitby Jet. Any luck, there might be a gladiator jet. <laughs> <laughs> Is it Nugget or Nougat? Nougat. The Blitz. I like this little tiny outlet, it's really cute, aren't I they? had the Blitz in Thailand and Costa Rica. <laughs> <laughs> What were the guy from uh, Spandau Ballet called? Tony Hadley. Tony Hadley. He must work there. Looks like he's uh, investing in a fish and chip bar. Yeah. In fact, it looks like there's a few 80s uh, pop stars that have set up business. You've got Ton <laughs> Tony Hadley's. Yeah. And then the Edge from U2. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and the Four Seasons. <laughs> I wonder if they've done that on purpose. No. Well, can't you remember that band, Bear Tree Interiors? They were good. <laughs> <laughs> this is a swing bridge. It's always busy, isn't it, Whitby? Yeah. Always. I like it, though. <laughs> I like that. Don't know who he's messing with. We're from town. We'll have him. Bells are ringing. The bells! Oh, that's the Duke of York. Look, and the board in that allows dogs. Who's that guy? Is that Captain Cook up there? Extreme danger from wave action. They're not bothered, are they? Look at them. That's stormy, that, isn't it? Yeah. He's made it to the beach, it's so exciting! <laughs> Be very careful when you try to get scenic shots. Oh, I'm getting wet feet again. They're looking for fossils. Yeah. I've got one. I've got one. <laughs> Take her away. Yeah. <laughs> Polish her up. There's two problems in the van. Right, what? You. <laughs> <laughs> you and, and the you. dog. <laughs> <laughs> There's a leak. I think it's condensation. Oh, yeah, I think it's your leak. sweating that's doing that. I don't really sweat very much. But yeah, there's a leak. So what do we? What, what do you think we need to do about that? Well, I say we. I mean you. I think it's, I think it's condensation. So there's that. But the other thing is, since yesterday, yeah. there's a smell in that van. <laughs> a, you're laughing at me, but there's there a, is smell. a slight smell. It smells. Well, I couldn't smell it yesterday. It smells like. I don't know. I just, like, thought, I just thought it was you. There's a bit of a fishy smell in that van. Yeah, I, I, there is now, I, I, I agree, I don't know what it is though. So, when I get back to the van, yeah. I'm having a look. What, tonight? No, when we get back up, I've oh, got okay. to get everything out. We can't, I can't be driving to work and smelling like that. You might have blown away. But it hasn't, it's got worse. When I came back from the, uh, what do you call it, toilets, it stinks. <laughs> it's got worse. I could okay. smell it when I got in. I'll help you have a look with that then. So we're all Dracula then. Brad Stoker. Bram, not Brad. <laughs> you said it was Brad Stoker. Brad Stoker. Harry's bar. What are you having? Who's Harry? It's got Yay. an H on it for ha ha ha. <laughs> <laughs> ha. Captain Cook. So there are the whale bones. They seem smaller than when I were a kid. That's come from Alaska. I thought it was caught here. Interesting. Yeah, and a great Yorkshireman. So he's from Yorkshire. I didn't even realise that, did you? You didn't. You just realised that now, haven't Why you? Why did you? You've just realised that now, this very second. Yeah, did he set off from here then, did you say? Well, they're the Whitby ships. Is he from Whitby? <laughs> <laughs> now you put doubt in my mind. I, thought, I always thought you were from Whitby. Well, it says, for the lasting memory of a great Yorkshireman. So he's from Yorkshire. I think with this with this statue being here, I'm gonna take a wild guess to say that oh, it's yeah. probably from Whitby. Yeah, it's Whitby the birthplace. Tim the Whitby Cook. mystery. 
No, he wasn't born here. No, he wasn't. He was born in Martin. Where's Martin? Yeah, he wasn't born here. Yeah. Okay. Well, we know now, don't we? When he's gone, it'd be even better. Captain Cook lived on Great Plain. Did he? Yeah. Is this Great Plain? Yes, it is. So that's where he lived. I think they're expecting him back. We've got a Sunday dinner out. <laughs> it's been there a while. Right, I'm gonna count these steps again. Okay. One, two, three. That little girl's put me off my count. 98, 99, 200. That can't be right, can it? Well, it's obvious. There's more going up than coming back down. It's obvious. So what do you think to Whitby then? I really enjoyed it. Yeah, I like Whitby. Come on, get in. Don't shove me on that fence. No. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> it stinks. What is it? Can't you smell that? Yeah, I can now. Yeah, I can now. Oh. What is it? I don't know. Is it your pants? <laughs> no. I've got the same ones on. <laughs> it's a joke. Actually, it's not, is it? No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's some... Right. Watch that thing. We need to... Let's get sorted and have a look round for what this smell is. It's not that. That could do with a wipe, Let's that down now, do it now. Let's have a wipe and get that sorted. Yeah. So it's not the table. It's not the rubbish bag because that wasn't there yesterday. Well, it weren't as bad yesterday. You said you could smell it yesterday. No, I could smell like mayonnaise when I got in. They've got a good spot. The more I looked, the worse the smell seemed to get. I looked in the glove box. I even looked where I put my second latte that I don't tell Claire about. I looked under the bed, I looked over the bed, but nothing I did seemed to be able to help me find where the smell was coming from. I was at a loose end and I didn't know what to do. And then it dawned on me. Claire had had a tuna sandwich. As I retrace our steps through the weekend, walking the streets of Whitby and thinking about our drive across the North Yorkshire Moors, it seemed to make more and more sense. And then I remembered when Claire came to pick me up from work. As she drove up to me, I could see that she was doing something with her mouth and hiding something beneath the dashboard. It was time to confront her and find out what really, truly happened this weekend. Claire? Yeah? When have you had a tuna and sweet corn sandwich? What? Or half a one? <laughs> well, are you asking me a question? Yeah. Oh, yeah. When did you have that? Because you've left it inside, that's what's smelling. It stinks. I had a little sandwich yesterday. I know when you had it. You know why I know? Why? Because I've checked. I'll get rid of the sandwich, sorry. You're not really sorry, are you? I'm Was really it nice? Sorry. Yeah. You didn't finish it, why didn't you finish it? I'm full.